wonderful people. We are here at Grant Elementary School for the annual Read Across America event. The event where lots of cool literacy things happen. Things to promote intelligence. Because there is such a thing as a book. Let's take a look-see. <laughs> this was a really good year for me. It's where I learned how to tell time. I didn't, I, didn't learn, I didn't learn anything this year. This was a really great year for me. This was the first time I read The Odyssey. We're here with some more readers. Can you guys please tell us who you are and who you represent? My name's Erica, and we're from the UC Cooperative Extension. If you had one piece of nutritious advice to give to the students here, what would it be? Less soda, more water, more fruits and vegetables, less hot Cheetos. <laughs> All of that, and be active. Run around and play. It's the best thing you can do for yourself. That's what kids love to do. I agree. Knuckle touch. Exactly. <laughs> oh, that's good. We have an early reader here. You know it's never too young to start reading, right? So if you had one piece of advice to give the children here, what would it be? Read something every day. Work at your reading every day. So here we are with another responsible leader. Can you please tell us who you are and who you represent? My name is Elaine Merriweather and I represent all the children in West Contra Costa Unified School District. I'm on the school board. This is a wonderful event. Every um, age is represented here and all the literacy and reading that students need, they're demonstrating it here tonight. All right, so we're here with one of our awesome readers, Leslie, she's in the fourth grade. Tell us, Leslie, how does it feel to be in the fourth grade? Good, but sometimes I struggle because I have the hardest fourth grade teacher with is Miss Flores. I'm sure Miss Flores isn't all that bad, is she good? Yeah, but she's fun and all, but she could be hard and yeah, on it. So you, you're here? Do you, do you like reading? Do you like reading? Because I know a lot of little kids don't really like reading, but I know you. You like reading, right? I like reading and writing. So, so what kind of books did you read? I like Dr. Seuss's book or E.B. White book or R.L. Stein's book. Wow. So how do you feel about President Barack Obama's foreign policy on Korea? I think he's doing great uh, for being the president. I agree. Thank you for your time. Knuckle touch. We're here with one of Grant Elementary School's loving families. Can you guys please tell us who you are? Tom Cordova. Anita Cordova. Angelina Cordova. Brianna Cordova. So tell us how you guys feel about this, this wonderful event right now. It's nice. It's good for the children. I like it. I like it. If you had one piece of advice for the students here, what would it be? Go get a book. Read it. <laughs> so we got some cool, wonderful reader students here. So can you guys please introduce us to who you are? I'm Joanna. I'm Leslie. So how are you guys, you know, feeling about this event right now? It's awesome. It's fun. It's, you can learn stuff, new stuff. You could learn how to read. You can enter a spelling bee. You could have free books. So tell us, if you had a piece of advice you can give to these students about their knowledge and, and doing well, what would it be? It would be to build lots of confidence, okay, and work really, really hard. Now that's kind of cliche, but working hard, you know, it's different for everybody depending on what level you, that you're at, but hard work always pays off in one way or another, and that helps you build confidence, and once you have confidence, you can do anything you want. I agree, hard work and confidence. Thank you for your time, Knuckle Touch. Um, you can play with Play-Doh, you could have food, you can read books. You can play with kids. <laughs> Thank you. So we're here with another reader. Can you please tell us who you are and who you represent? Yes, my name is Gail McLaughlin. I'm the mayor of the city of Richmond. So, you know, being the Green Party mayor that you are, you, you, could you recommend any green books for our students? Mm. Well, you know, any kind of books that look at cleaning up our neighborhoods, cleaning up our air, our water, um, you know, anything that shows that young people can be a part of shifting um, away from, you know, from the way the planet is currently uh, being run with too many cars and not enough bicycles and not enough walking. Greening the planet is something that everybody has to get around. I agree. I agree. I think I need to get one of those books. So thank you for your time. Knuckle touch. All right. <laughs> <laughs> and the little pigs ran all the way home. All right. Oh, you saw that? Well, this was such a wonderful experience for me and the people of Richmond. I hope you guys enjoyed it just as much as I have. Knuckle touch.